up guys? Lexi C here, back at it again with another video. I am excited for this video because I literally feel like guys are going to learn so much from this video. If you're a guy, take tab, take notes. This is all gross things that girls do. And I'm not joking you, we all do it. Let's just get right into it. The first thing on our list is worn the same bra for several days or even weeks in a row. Uh, duh, yeah, we wear the same bra. Okay, I don't wanna sound too gross, but I can have like a total of like two bras that I actually wear. If it's a sports bra, if I'm working out, then yeah, I'm obviously gonna like wear a new bra every day wash it but like it's just like the everyday bra what's the point of changing it okay and worn the same pajamas for several days or longer my sister makes fun of me so bad we facetime every night she's like you wear the same thing in bed every night i'm like i know i'm gross smelled clothes you've already worn to see if they're too stinky to wear or not absolutely guilty of this no doubt we've all done it guys have done this too y'all don't even probably smell them y'all just freaking wear them nasty not wash your hair for a few days in a row current situation it's such a mess that's why it's curly and with hairspray if my hair is slicked back in a pony that means it hasn't been washed for like a week. That's nasty. Watch your head and expected the skin under your nails afterwards. Oh no, I've never done this. I have, however, scratched my head and like smelled my hand to see if my hair smells. Right now my hair smells good and I haven't washed it for a while. But I've never scratched and ex inspected my nail. That's gross. That's that's gross. Use hairspray or dry shampoo to cover up the smell of unwashed hair. Absolutely. Dry shampoo saves my life and my hair holds curl better if it's dirty eating food out of your bra that fell in there by accident yeah honestly it's like a nice little like i don't know like a nice little basket if i have on the right bra like scrape your teeth with your fingernails just out of curiosity scrape your teeth with your oh to see if there's anything on them no however i do get lipstick on my teeth a lot i just gotta do like a but maybe i'll start trying i mean i floss Scrape to dirt out of your nails, particularly when they're long. Oh yeah. You wanna know what I scrape most? Okay, so I just tore off all my fake nails, literally right before I was filming these videos. You get food under your nails, you get dirt under your nails. Like it's really gross. Scrape dirt out from under your toenail, particularly the big one. No, because my toenails, I try to not let them grow. I can feel if my toenails are growing, you'll feel it, especially if you're like running or whatever. So like I've never scraped dirt out from under my toenail. That's disgusting. Picked at chipping nail polish. Absolutely, I'm always picking at my nails. Pick the dead skin off your lips. I use this lip plumping stuff to make my lips like juicier. And sometimes it tingles so bad, but like sometimes it like dries your lips out. Gotten a deep satisfaction out of squeezing oil and dirt out of your pores. Absolutely not, that's gross. I'm gonna wash my face, I'm gonna do my nightly routine, but I'm not gonna do all that. But honestly, like I feel like I'm not as gross as a lot of girls. Inspect pore strips for a very long time, admiring the oil and dirt you got out because it looked a little, like a little forest. Okay, so. I once in a while will do like the face mask stuff. I, I just like, I wash my face, I use my nightly routine, but like I'm not huge into like the strips that are supposed to pull out everything because I've seen like videos of what comes out and it's so gross. A few times I have done it, I haven't sat there and evaluated it because it makes me wanna freaking puke, like ew. Left makeup on overnight because you couldn't be bothered to wash it off before bed. Me, every time I get drunk, you know that I'm drunk if I don't take my makeup off because I am so religious about taking off my makeup, brushing my teeth, my retainer. I gotta keep the style looking nice. You feel me? If I don't take off my makeup, your girl had a wild night. She is wildin. All right? Or an underwear that has a hole or two or three and if no one's gonna see them but you it's fine however if it's the other way around you better have you already know i'm gonna have my nice little victoria's secret 
Waited to do laundry until you ran out of underwear. Oh no, not even. Waited to do laundry until I've already gone commando for like a week. To the point where I don't have any underwear, so I'm literally just not wearing underwear. That's when I decide to do laundry. You know what? We get busy sometimes. This is a judgment-free zone. Y'all are probably judging me, but I'm telling you, oh, commando. It's actually probably comfier without your underwear than with. Take a particularly deep wedgie out of your butt. I'm gonna take it one step further. Boys, you're gonna hate me. Here's, okay, so with thongs, you can take wedgie to a whole new level where it's like the front wedgie. So far up your back that you like, that it hurts when you pull it. But I could fill you in on this. Eat in the shower for convenience. It is so rare that I do this, like so rare. I am not a shower peer. I think it's disgusting. I do not support the peeing in the shower thing at all. Pee before you get in the shower. Don't flush because it'll make your shower water cold. However, when you get out, you can flush. Don't pee in the shower. I'm not a huge shower peer, but I have done it. Not showered for one, two, or more days. Sometimes though, I'm so guilty of this, like not very often, but like work out sometimes really late at night. My gym is 24, <laughs> my gym is 24 hours. I sometimes work out at like 11 at night. Don't get done till 12. So tired from all my cardio that I just like lay in my bed and then I end up falling asleep. Just a Q-tip Scrape the inside of your ear, then inspect that the wax that came out. Yes, of course. If you don't inspect the wax that came out, like you have to keep the AirPods clean, you guys, because if you don't clean your ears and you wear AirPods, they will. Oh, these aren't AirPods. My AirPods, okay, not gonna lie, like the low-key, my AirPods like got really quiet, and I think it might be because of the wax. Every guy that thought I was cute before this video ever happened probably thinks that I'm some type of ratchet type of girl. So I'm I apologize if that's the case. Okay, smelled your own farts, even the really bad ones. Ew! I don't know. We're not talking about that. Wash just your crotch instead of taking a full shower. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. How to do your hair and your makeup. We don't have time for a full body shower. We have time for a crotch wiping and that's it. Smell your own breath, especially when your mouth tasted like garbage. Okay, I'm, a, I'm a gum chewer. I always have gum in my mouth. I'm one of those people that chomps on my gum like louder than anybody in the world. Smell your armpits after sweating for a while. Yeah, you gotta keep check. Like there's no shame in that. Like if you think you might smell, smell them because if you do, you need to take Take care of it. Dug out all the hair from your hair brush with an old bobby pin. Oh girl, I just used my hand. Broke your leg hair during a particular prickly phase because it, ew, uh-uh. I do not do leg hair. I shave my legs every single day. Like, it takes two seconds, literally da 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 da. I think that took me 10 seconds. Just be walking around with their hairy gorilla legs. That's not me. And I, I'm, I have like lighter hair. I don't grow like a lot of leg hair. Never like a huge issue for me, but like if you shave your legs every day like it's really not that big of a deal making a wall mural with stray hairs in the shower that's disgusting my best friend in the entire world does this and it grosses me out so bad so bad throw it away why hang your hair your wet ass nasty hair in the shower on the shower wall for you to look at like it's a freaking art painting clogging the drain with all the hair okay the the drain clogging is not an issue when you only wash your hair once or twice a week so it's not a huge issue for me Shift our armpits to check for bo yeah i mean check yourself going to town on an ingrown hair and marveling at the root when you finally yank it out i've never yanked out an ingrown hair i have had them they hurt but again just like if you pop a pimple popping or pulling or irritating that more is not gonna help you like people really be like going to town on it. Bang and instantly weighing yourself to see if you lose a pound while looking to see if your stomach is flat or freaking lutely I love being skinny. Hello. Sometimes I'll like drink a coffee and eat dates just because I know it's going to make me go to the bathroom and then I'll look skinny. <laughs> Waiting way longer than you should to wash your jeans and your hoodies and your bras. Oh yeah. Like I said, I already go commando for weeks until I like run out of underwear to do my laundry. So I'm not the best laundry doer. You've gone so long without washing your hair that it's almost even gross. Amen. Pop and zits. 
I don't pop zits. Same goes for popping other people's zits. Whoever you are out there that enjoys popping other people's zits, don't talk to me. Ew, that's gross. Eating a granola bar or chewing a piece of gum you find at the bottom of your bag despite not knowing how long it's been there. Ew, the gum. When the gum has like halfway out of the wrapper and has like crumbs and like, ew. But you're like desperate because you want to have like good smelling breasts. So you're like, you just go with it. Okay, I hope I didn't gross you guys out too much. It's important that you guys know what us nasty girls be doing. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Leave a comment of what you think the nastiest thing that I've said in this video is because I've said some really ratchet stuff. Alright, that's it. I'll see you again for another video tomorrow.